What's happening guys and welcome back to another great video on our channel. While many might not have heard of VeChain, it's one of the more established brands in crypto and blockchain technology. In this video, we're taking a look at what VeChain or Vent Cryptocurrency is. Number 5. Establishment and History Before we get into the nitty gritty details of what VeChain really is, let's take a look at the history of the company and when it came to existence. Back in 2015, when crypto was starting to gain a bit of steam in the mainstream media, VeChain was established as an ERC20 token on the EDH network. This meant that at the time, the company didn't have its own network to rely upon for any of its tasks. Nonetheless, it made good use of the EDH network and this led to them ICOing their company, which we'll be talking about a bit later on. Back then, the main coin that was used by the company was called Ven, which was later changed to VET. This then had a very rough few years in the beginning, but after much effort from the people behind the company, it peaked in around 2018. Number 4. Raising Funds After the private company VeChain had made a lot of progress towards their goals, they did what any other private company would be expected to do, an ICO. An ICO stands for Initial Coin Offering, and companies do that when they want to raise some capital in order to fund their venture. This is much like the IPO that some other private companies do, but the main difference is that an ICO is unregulated. After this ICO, the VeChain company switched gears and left the Ethereum network. They established their own network called the VeChain Thor and they started using that in July of 2018. This was all possible due to the $20 million that they raised with their ICO. Using their own network not only simplifies things for them as they can design it any way they want, but it also allows them to keep a close eye on the inner workings of the system. Number 3. Main Purpose of Existence Thus far, we've gone through the establishment of the company, but what does it really do? Well, to put things simply, it's a supply chain management system that's used by a lot of big companies around the world. The main use of this platform is to track where something is after it's been sent from the original company. In the past, RFID and NFC were used to track a parcel from a sender to a receiver, but due to inconsistencies, a lot of stuff was lost on the way. Well, by using VeChain technologies, companies can now keep an even closer eye on the stuff they send out. Believe it or not, but big companies like Louis Vuitton and BMW are known to use this technology extensively. But why is it better than the traditional methods? Let's dive into that right now. Number 2. Main Advantage of VeChain There are a lot of things that are better about the VeChain system, but prime among them is the fact that they're based on blockchain technologies. As you might know, that entire system is decentralized. What this means is that it cannot be easily manipulated by just anyone and ends up making it a lot more secure than the traditional systems that were in place in the past. That doesn't mean that companies have stopped using the older methods, but what happens now is that while companies still use things like scanners and RFID tags, the data is now stored on the blockchain. This doesn't just end up making it more secure, but also more accessible, as anyone with the proper credentials can track the entire history of a certain item. Speaking of proper credentials, did you know that this is another way where VeChain is a bit ahead of its competitors? Number 1. Consensus Model When someone is looking to invest in any project related to cryptocurrency, one of the main things that they look for is the type of consensus model they use. What this denotes is how the company is controlled and how certain key decisions are made. VeChain uses a proof of authority system that's much like the proof of stake system used by a lot of other crypto companies, but it does vary in one key area. In this system, the VeChain Foundation themselves chooses which nodes get authority in their system. This means that each person that controls the company's future has been thoroughly vetted prior to gaining their portion of control. Aside from that, they also need to own 25 million VET in order to gain authority. So these were some of the details about VeChain and its cryptocurrency. The entire system is fascinating, but keep in mind, it's only intended to be used by big organizations and not individuals. And then that calls into question, you know, the everything that's going to going on here. Now, it wouldn't be an impulsive structure or anything like that. Well, guys, this about wraps up our video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell so you don't miss out on future videos. And if you enjoy the content, 
then do let us know by smashing that like button. And until next time, take care and goodbye.